Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Open XCOM. We've got, um, we're still on a terror mission, taking out scores of Reapers and Floaters and all of that rubbish. And we're about to end our turn, because we're looking for the probably last one. What the hell was that? Oh, just doors closed, these doors closed, okay. They certainly sound like bloody UFO doors, that's for sure. Now, the only things I can think of is that that guy's on the roof or in that house right over here. But the doors here haven't been opened, but that doesn't mean much. I mean, he, he could still be in there. So, um, let's go. World at War. See what we can see over here. Uh, think, oh, great, we're out of time units. Eddie Boo is gonna support him. Lurker! Nothing here. I'm just gonna keep people outside then. Looking out to see if I can find them or spot them or whatever. End man. One big fat guy. Arcania, let's... Oh, I didn't want to go into that corner, but fine. He's obviously not here. Paddle bunny. Let's go up. See what we can see. Uh, I bet he's on the roof, but I'm gonna go up there next turn, so I have some points to shoot. And just them all. We'll join Battle Bunny. Why did you take that weird route there? That's a bit odd. Right, anyone else? Alex? Check these. Okay. And Snake. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. We'll see him. We'll see him. Where? Ah, he's there. Yeah. He was on, well, almost on the roof. Ah, oh, damn, 50. We're not gonna... Come on. Ah, oh, that was so close. Yes! Excellent, and that was it. Aliens killed 10. Alien corpses recovered. Live alien aliens, 5. Alien artifacts. Civilians killed by aliens, only 1. That was brilliant. I didn't see any other civilians, actually. Civilians saved 1. <laughs> there were 2 civilians on that map. And 1 XCOM operative killed. This is not excellent. 461 points. This is only good. Small rocket too, okay. No promotions. Seriously? I got no promotions. Let's get another another recruit. And let's get the small rocket, large rocket. What is this large rocket? Does it say anything on the UFOpedia? XCOM craft, heavy weapons, weapons and equipment. Um rocket launcher. Oh, there we go. High explosive, high explosive incendiary. Was this in the original? I'm not sure they were. Huh. Uh, anyway, the rocket launcher is a laser-guided system which can fire three different sizes of missile. Yeah, laser-guided my ass. 115% accuracy, right? Um... High explosive. Oh, so this is the small rocket and this is the big rocket. It's got a bit more punch. Uh, it's probably a lot heavier, so I'm not a huge fan of that. So let's just buy more um, small rockets, because I think that uh, they work quite nicely, to be honest. Let's get 10. Incendiary rockets I could get as well, but meh. Maybe a, a few large rockets, why not? Proximity grenades, you know what? I'm actually going to get a few of those. I have people use them for uh, for UFOs and such. All right, so there we go: small rocket, large rocket, and proximity grenade. Can I stuff anything more on this Sky Ranger? I kind of doubt, but we'll see. Um, small rocket. Let's have a few. Let's have a few big ones. Grenade, proximity grenades. Excellent. How much stuff does it go on the Sky Ranger? And wait a second. We've got two spaces left. Ah, Arcania is wounded. Okay. Let's actually, um, every now and then, let's go through the soldiers and see what their stats are, shall we? I think people quite like that. Jasmine has increased a little bit. Four missions, three kills. Not bad. Uh, Alex has increased quite a bit. Four missions, three kills. Very low bravery, unfortunately. Strength is quite a lot. World at War. Our captain. Four missions, three kills. Firing accuracy went up like crazy. He'll be our main sniper, I guess. Um, Snake is quite good as well. 
our sergeant, four missions, five kills. Then we have Eddie Boo with four missions and two kills. Very nice firing accuracy, Eddie Boo. Lurker with four missions and one kill. Not bad. Captain K, the second sergeant, zero kills. How are you a sergeant? Still, okay firing accuracy. Uh, Damon, Esquadia, three missions, one kills. Tang Dempsey at three missions, one kills. And man, bloody hell, the firing accuracy. Three missions, one kills. One big fat guy, three missions, two kills. Arcania, only for one day, that's good, two kills. Paddle Bunny the second, okay, we've uh, gone around. Well, that's pretty good. How's the research going? Average on that uh, rifle, but when we get it, it's gonna be much nicer. Living quarters complete. Research complete, there we go. This is a devastatingly powerful weapon based on accelerating particles from within a m minute anti-gravity field. Right, so now we have to research the plasma rifle clip if we want to use it, obviously. There we go. Plasma rifle, yes! Wait, uh, what does it use? Alien allies, and we have quite a few. How many do we already have, I wonder? Cell. Um, plasma rifle. We've got eight! That is brilliant! That is very good! Okay, let's just uh, research that clip first, if we can. That's gonna be great. Okay, we also have to do allies as quickly as possible. How actually base information? Where's the alien containment? Five out of ten. Oh, interesting. So I have to build more. Um, alien contain, or should I just sell them? Yeah, after every mission, I'll just sell the uh, corpses, I guess. Reaper terrorist. There we go. Oh, you can sell live ones. Of course, I've enabled that. Because I think it's quite a nice little idea. You can sell it to, you know, governments so they can research them. Florida corpse, 17 corpses, bloody hell. Wait a second. Ah, so it didn't have 5 out of 10 aliens, it's just, it's just a random number. Mine probes, don't need them, so I'll just sell. Oh, it's huge money. Illyrium, alien grenades, plasma pistols, 25 of them. Don't need the pistols, they're not really that great. Plasma pistol clip. Look at all that money! Okay. That's good. Sell. Well, I can certainly get those scientists now, if I want. Look at that. 50 scientists. 3 million. Not bad. Right, give me that research. Come on, come on, before I get uh, any more... Uh, where's... South Africa. Where the hell is Southern Africa? There we go. Bloody hell. Yeah, it's certainly gone really up Europe as well, but we should be detecting stuff. Yeah, so Europe and Southern Africa. Large radar system complete. Excellent. So we'll have more of a chance. Are they seriously researching the uh, plasma rifle clip for that long and it's still unknown? Holy crap. Scientists. Excellent. Can we make even more? No? Okay, so we need two projects. Let's do the... Alien alloys first. Oh, we got lots of stuff. Corpse, corpse. Only the Reaper survived alive. Uh, so alien alloys first. Could do the grenades as well. What? 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 Oh, I don't have the... Ah, I don't have the laboratory yet. No, 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 no. Great. And of course, I'm going to be paying for the scientists. And I don't have the lab yet. Jeez. That was a stupid mistake. Oh, well. Never mind. Research complete. There we go. This small object is used as a power source for a plasma rifle. A medium-powered alien weapon. Contains a small quantity of Illyrium. Now we are in business. Plasma cannon as well. Um, actually, first of all, I think I want to do alien allies. There. Let's also allocate research. Plasma rifle clips. We've got a lot of Illyrium, but we'll need a lot of clips for now. Let's just do it like this. And also, let's get more... Yeah, let's get more 
uh, engineers. They're not going to be here before the end of the month, so that's okay. We should probably make another living space. Actually, let's wait for the end of the month. I don't know if under construction stuff is... Uh... Oh crap, I'm going to get those engineers, aren't I? Uh, oh. Excellent project monthly report. Excellent. The Council of Funding Nations is very pleased with your excellent progress. Keep up the good work. Russia, UK, France, Germany, Spain, China, Japan, India, Brazil, Nigeria, and Egypt are particularly happy with your progress in dealing with the local alien incursion and have agreed to increase their funding. Excellent. That's uh, quite nice. There we go. And then the engineers arrive. So how much... Oh, crap. Yeah, that's... Uh that's expensive. <laughs> that is expensive. Um, oh, we only have that funding. I, I meant like... What's our basic funding? Uh, there's a monthly cost. There we go. Income, 6.3. Total, 6.1. <laughs> yeah, I have way too many scientists. Way too many. I mean... I guess I could keep them for now and just do loads of research, but that's yeah, gonna be... Let's make all that as much as we can. And we'll just have to keep selling stuff, I guess. Alright, equip, equip craft. Get all the rifles down, because we've got something much better now. Much better. Only eight of them, unfortunately, but that's alright. There we go. Okay, so we've got eight of these. We've got nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay. So let's do it like this. Okie dokie. That's gonna be good. Right, so can I get some uh, UFOs maybe? Would be nice. I mean, I kinda need them. Already. Complete. Bloody hell, that was quick. Uh, why can't I start this? Units required 1, available 76, workspace required 4. What? Oh, I don't have the funds for it. Oh, shite. Uh, Reaper Terrorist, you have a navigation. I could sell a power source, but that's... Yeah. Alien grenade, plasma pistol clips, rifle clips. Yeah, I... Yeah. Can I sell anything? <laughs> no, I will need to get... Uh, well, at least we can start researching in one day. There we go. At least I can start some really heavy research now. So hopefully that's going to offset the costs and we'll just have to destroy more UFOs. Come on, give, give me some UFOs, please. There we go. Alien craft are constructed from special alloys with unique properties. They're extremely light and durable and can be moduled, uh, molded by electromagnetic methods. This material can be reproduced and used in many kinds of manufacturing processes. Which is kind of funny because we were already, you know, could use it. Personal armor, that's what we want. All 100 scientists are going to be working on that. And then we will have no money to produce them unless we get some UFOs. So please... UFOs! Oh yeah, we can make these. How many do we actually have? It's 3,000 per unit. How many... Oh, there we go. Small. If it was to land, that would be pretty perfect. Do we have uh, soldiers? Let's see. Crew. Where's the extra soldier I ordered? Huh. It's kind of weird. I'll just do it like this, just in case. Okay, let's send... This is low and very slow, so I'm gonna send you. And I'm also gonna send War Dragon. No, this is a small one. Let's send Mr. Pid. Mr. Pid has lighter weapons. Yeah, this one is gonna land, I believe. No? Where are you going, little guy? Stop! Slight new target. He's going for India somewhere. It... Yes. Oh. Oh, this is Mr. Pid. Okay. Go and get him. There he is. Is he gonna land? Probably not. Go... Go after the UFO. 
Yeah, this is new, you have to... Oh, there he is. But we're never gonna get that with the Sky Ranger in time. Tracking lost! He was right there! He was... He was right there. Oh no, I used 30 minutes and he ran away? Was that it? I'm not sure. Crap! Okay, never mind. Just go back. Darn it. That was a sh... There we go. Another very small... That's a very small one. Is that Sky Ranger? It is. And it would be at night, so... Tracking lost. Brilliant. Well, come on. Nope. Return to base. Return to sender. Darn UFOs. Darn them. I need some UFOs here. There we go. Personal armor. Finally, some protection for people. Uh, do we have anything really nice at the moment? Well, I, I could go for the power source and get the power armor. <laughs> I think that's all you need. Or is the heavy cannon as well? Plasma cannon would be quite nice, but I want the... What? Oh yeah, you need to do Illyrium 115 and power source, I believe, for the power armor. So maybe I should do that. Yeah, Illyrium. Let's do that. And then the power source. But I'm gonna be so low on money. Personal armor. Can we even make any? 22,000 per unit. Well, let's allocate every engineer we have. And let's make one. <laughs> oh, we can actually make two. Yay! Unless we sell stuff. There we go. That's complete. Ah, oh, for Pete's sake, can I get some UFOs? This is getting a bit ridiculous. Navigation. Well, these are quite nice, but... I'm gonna sell two navigations for now. So I can manufacture more. Uh, personal armor. All of them! Uh, how many? I didn't see how much money I had. 167, and it's 22. Yeah. Oh. There we go. Small, very low. Uh, Mr. Pitt, let's go. Let's also equip our soldiers with armor. Um, wait, actually, the, um, the ranking people. Why does it not have a rank here? That's stupid. So who does have rank? Captain K has rank, and World at War has rank, and some other people probably. So don't hate me if I missed you. I wish this guy would land when we got there and it was daytime, but... Oh, uh, there we go. Uh, what is it? Let's get it down. Oh, you've only got short range. That's not right. Nice. Ah, you bastard. Come on, get it. Get it! If you're gonna lose the tracking, I'm gonna be mad. War Dragon, let's go. There he is. There we go, crash lands, excellent. Okay, we're gonna wait over here a bit. Because I want daylight, obviously. Because dark is, darkness is bad. Alright, select new target. Let's go for the crash site. Hopefully, the uh, power source is intact. Because I could really use some... Uh, look at... Uh, I could really use some... Um, well, stuff right now. Some money. Alright, but now we've got plasma rifles. Oh yeah. Not a lot of plasma clips though. Huh. Okay. These are also... Are these lighter? 17. Let's see. Yeah, they're also lighter. Bloody hell. Better all around. Here's some uh, grenades as well. Why not? There. Uh, then we have you with all these rockets. Yeah, these are quite heavy. Uh, you can have a few. Why not? Yeah, that's that's too much. So you can have that. Then we have World at War. 
who obviously needs a plasma. What the hell are these? Oh, proximity, of course. I'm gonna have to use those for uh, breaching UFOs. Another one, there we go. Snake, you've got the nice stuff. You can have these as well. Eddie Boo. Eddie Boo. Uh, let's have some proximity grenades. And rifle, of course. There we go. Nice. At the weight limit. 75 accuracy. That's so good. Uh, okay, lurker. Can have some proximity grenades as well. You're quite uh, nice. The problem with this is... Um, if they kill a soldier, a soldier like this, they're, they're gonna drop all that stuff onto the ground, and if an explosion hits it, it's gonna be bad. It's gonna be very bad. Demon. I have some proximity grenades as well, and of course, a clip. Tang Dempsey. There you go. Oops. An N-Man. N-Man has loads of accuracy. Yeah, 72. That's very, very nice. And then we have... Oh. Nothing for one big fat guy. What? I thought we had another plasma. <coughs> Damn it. Okay, he's just gonna have to deal with this then for now. Do it with uh, proximity grenades. And another one. Darn. Arcania forbidden. Well, that's it. Have this grenade. And battle bunny. Jeez. Give me some clips then. Okay, we definitely need more plasma rifles. Alright, there we go. We're all ready at the moment. And we're gonna continue next time. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.